Welcome back to my channel. My name is Ray Ray. Thank you guys so much for watching. Today's video is going to be just a little bit different from what I usually do and I'm super excited about it. I've reached this stage where I'm tired of seeing the same hair, like the same style, doing the same thing pretty much every day. It's a little bit too repetitive and I just want to try like different looks whether it's wigs or you know braiding hair but still keep it in the natural department. And the crazy thing is that I haven't worn a wig in probably like three or four years, which is crazy to me. Her Given Hair actually reached out to me um, a little while ago and I actually partnered up with them like in the past, like a few years ago. And they reached out to me and I was just like, this is such a great time. You know, I went on their website and I found this wig. And when I'm telling you, I got so excited because I've never found like one that is so so close to my natural hair texture and I'm gonna show you exactly what wig I'm talking about but this is the packaging it came in like super cute you know and simple and um, this is the wig this is um, coily and it's 3C4A up close which is pretty much my natural hair texture but the only difference is just that I have just a tiny bit of 4D in it I never really cared about the length it was it's always been like the volume so I missed that and I was like oh my god like that's just perfect you know I've never been the one to be into wigs and first of all like I'm so lazy when it comes to that and I don't know how to do the whole tilling part foundation here concealer here and laying your edges and making sure that it still looks natural and you know the HD lace my, oh my god like this is too much for me so I really wasn't trying to find something that would take much of my time I will tell you exactly why I feel like it's beginner friendly is because the inside you pretty much have everything you need to make the whole installation super super easy and fast see uh, three combs one on, one on each side and then one at the bottom you have the elastic band and then you have the adjustable straps to make sure that it fits your head perfectly so i'm just like it's pretty much everything i want in a wig on top of it it has bangs so i won't have to do much the only thing that i did washed it so i used shampoo and conditioner and put it in the plastic bag let it sit for like one to two hours and just rinsed it off and let it air dry so you really don't have to do much what i have here is some water and i mixed it with live-in conditioner just so it can be like extra extra uh, moisturized anyways i feel like i've been talking for a while now so um i'm just gonna put it on but what i'm gonna do first is wear my wig cap yeah i'm probably gonna end up adding it so this is what it's looking like Dear, I've never actually seen a wig with the elastic band already installed. I really, really like that. The comb in the back. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Ah! Okay, there you go. So, I look crazy, but I'm gonna fix it. Yeah, I'm gonna create some sort of like bangs. I'm gonna fix the bangs. I have my shears, so I'm probably gonna... I have my shears, so I'm probably gonna like trim them. But for now, what I'm gonna do is water and live in conditioner just so it can like fall together. And I'm gonna shape it just so it can frame my face better. To be honest with y'all, I was only going with the flow during this process. I didn't have a specific shape in mind. I only wanted the hair to frame my face better. So there was a whole lot of playing with the hair, finger combing, etc. Just so I could have an idea of what part I specifically wanted to cut. Also, y'all, I had a towel facing me this whole entire time. But as soon as I started this process, I guess I zoned out and didn't realize I didn't have it on me until I was pretty much done. So please ignore that part. <laughs>
like I look like Loki um, Dora the Explorer right now. <laughs> All right, so far this is what I got. Still a little bit of work to do, but it's looking really good. I'm probably gonna do some more cutting, especially in the back, but I'm gonna wait until I finish up with this video because I just need to be in front of a, like a big mirror right now. I can't wait for it to dry just so I can see how big it gets on my head. Yeah, I definitely, okay, so I definitely like the messy look better. Like I said, you have the option to twist it out if you want, but I like this style better. I'm probably going to work on it and probably end up like that in black. I like how it's looking so far. I really do. I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys so much for watching remember remember to subscribe um give this video a thumbs up um click on that notification bell so you can get notified every single time i upload a new video and again thank you guys so much for watching i will see you guys next time bye